Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Empress Aries 888. My name is Tanya. Well, I hope you're having a wonderful morning, afternoon, or evening. Whatever time you press that play button. These are collective readings, any energy, any sign. Like on the way in, it gives me an energetic donation to the channel. And it helps me tune into you. And flip the roles as you see fit. I could be saying you and meaning your person. Could be saying your person and meaning you. Take what resonates and leave the rest. So, Spirit, give me a message for the overall collective, please. Let's see what Spirit has to say tonight. Spirit, give me a message, please. Leave. Okay, thank you. Thank you. All right, Spirit. So forgiveness is here. Clear your energy. Mm -hmm. Bottom of the deck is direction. Forgiveness. And forgiveness doesn't necessarily always mean forgiving a person. Or a situation it can mean forgiving yourself if I've learned anything from doing these readings I've learned that self-worth is a huge blockage when a person doesn't have it and you don't have self-worth you lack that there's a lot of blockages in life and some people I think we all are at one time or another, if we want to be honest, or can be hard on ourselves when we make mistakes. And I think there, this could be one of those situations. Let's look into it a little further. Spirit, give me some more information on that. Clearing your energy is super important because a lot of negativity can get attached to you, especially if you're an empath and you take on the feelings of other people you need to clear your energy because it, it can become your reality it's like all of a sudden you're in a bad mood and you don't know why it's not necessarily that you're in a bad mood it could be those around you are in a bad mood and you're attaching they're attaching their energy to yourself or you're picking up on their energies and it's attaching to you and becoming your reality so clear, clearing your energy is super important. There, give me some more information, please. I miss forgiveness. Thank you. Oh my God, it's double confirmation of this. Full moon in Pisces, forgive. Okay, forgive and be forgiven is what I'm hearing here. Mm. And look at here, it's double confirmation here. Clear your energy and full moon and Taurus at the bottom of the deck detoxify. Because like I said, a lot of toxic energies can attach themselves. And all of a sudden it becomes a weight that we have. Yeah, that's what I'm hearing from spirit then. All right, let's go into it, Spirit. Let's go into it. Give me some more clarification about this forgiveness. Mm -hmm. card keeps coming out so I'm going to use it it's the five of cups there's a loss of grief a sorrow disappointment yeah somebody's disappointed could be choices right four 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 on the clock there can be something about this what's going on here thank you a Knight of Cups, and Cups is water in the astrological signs of 
Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Somebody's following their heart. Somebody was a dream and they're following that. Yeah. Thank you. This person could be Ten of Wands. Somebody is burdened, exhausted, struggling. The moon's in reverse, but they're gaining clarity, finding the truth in a situation. Maybe at one time they were in love with somebody. Found that person to be charming is what I'm hearing. <laughs> But maybe they didn't necessarily follow that. And there's forgiveness here for a reason. Mm -hmm. Five of Pentacles. Pentacles is the Earth signs. Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Somebody could be taking a financial hit. Overcoming adversities, though. You're looking for forgiveness. See, forgiveness is here a few times. They made the wrong choices in a situation. Yeah. And they are kicking themselves and being hard on themselves about that, is what I'm hearing. The Queen of Swords. Swords is the air signs, Libra, Aquarius, and Gemini. And it looks like this person could be easily influenced, emotional overly critical or cold-hearted or it could be the person they're with maybe that's their choice they chose this person yeah right here the fool they want to take a leap of faith towards a new start because there's the ten of cups in the future there's somebody here at the beginning these cards the knight of cups there's somebody here that wants to follow their heart and they want to follow their heart towards this Ten of Cups, which is family, harmony, legacy. It's like everything. It's like the ultimate achievement in happiness in, in life, not necessarily work. Stability. Yeah, somebody was everything to this person, but they're looking for forgiveness from this person. And they are attached, though, to toxicities, to a person that's very negative right here in that Queen of Swords in reverse. Mm-hmm. Yep, that's what I'm hearing. So they made the wrong choice. They're, what is it, making their bed and lying in it, right? Lying in this situation that is weighing them down wishing and hoping for another chance to seek their happiness somewhere else yeah eight of pentacles but in the reverse no, but there was a lack of motivation maybe there's a lack of motivation currently where they're thinking about it but not moving on it because they just feel burdened and weighed down. Yeah. Ten of Pentacles, man. Inheritance, legacies, long-term success, money, family, everything. Ten of Pentacles, ten of Cups. The ultimate achievement in life and love. Something to be said here, man. Something to be said. Something's weighing them down. Something they need forgiveness for. A choice. That's what I'm hearing. A choice. A choice. The sun is here. Happiness. Success. Oh, God. It's all here in the cards. Page of Pentacles is here. Somebody's goal-oriented. Goal and planning something. Manifesting something. Wants an opportunity. But Paige is an immature energy. So look here. They want this Queen of Cups. The feminine. Kind. Empathetic. 
supportive person. So that's the person that they want forgiveness from, I guess. Because at the bottom of the deck here, it's two of swords. Indecision. And mental turmoil kept this person from choosing this Queen of Cups. And they want that forgiveness from this person. Eight of Cups in the reverse. Yeah, indecision. Staying in a bad situation. So staying in a bad situation with the Queen of Swords in reverse. The distorted Queen. And it's only blocked this person. The towers in reverse. Delayed. Delay in the inevitable. Yeah. 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 And they're looking for forgiveness from this Queen of Cups. Uh huh. Because there's all that happiness. And it could have been, it would have been that happiness, the Ten of Cups, the Ten of Pentacles, the Sun. But because of their fears or them staying stuck in a bad situation, they didn't go for it. Ace of Swords in the reverse. Yeah, miscommunication, man. Missed opportunity. That's how they feel. Now they're in self-reflective introspection. The Hermit's here. Mm -mm. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. They gave up a good thing. Seven of Swords in the reverse. And they want to change. They want to confess. They want to come clean. And they're determined to do that, to make a big change. Knight of Swords is here. Yeah. They're unhappy in their situation. And they know that their happiness is with the Queen of Cups. The Wheel of Fortune is here. It's a destiny that they have this. The Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. And they want to move on from the situation they're in now. Six of Swords. Yep. Travel to Tom of Waters. They lost you. And they're in their grief and disappointment about it. Mm-hmm. Put, could have put you in competition. Five of Swords is here. Yeah, a rival perhaps is somebody they chose over you. They want your forgiveness for that. They chose the wrong person. Yeah, it was a broken promise. King of Wands in the reverse. Impulsive choice. That led to their undoing is what I'm hearing. Yeah, undoing. Anything else before we end this spirit? Knight of Wands. Mm. <coughs> Excuse me. Now Wands is the um, fire signs. Aries Leo, and, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. And they can see you as very ambitious and brave. Fearless passionate, and they're very passionate about you, but somebody turned their head and tickled their ear, and said what they wanted to hear. They manipulated your person. The chariot, yeah. There is a forward movement in this situation. There is success. I mean, it's in the cards, the success is here. They look at you as innocent and carefree and playful. And you were to them. that They felt that way when they were with you. And now they're overburdened and sad and depressed. That of this mischance, yeah. Ace of Pentacles. It's frustrating them. But they need balance. Yeah, they need balance. They need to... The self-worth is in the toilet, you know? I, I just think that because of their self-worth... They saw things 
in a negative light. They couldn't appreciate how good you were to them. Because they were so used to the distorted queen of swords kind of person, you know? Mean, manipulative, one minute nice, the next minute, you know, twisting the knife type of person. They knew where they stood with somebody like that, but with you, they were afraid you were going to change into that kind of person. And I feel like they really wanted to believe in the good in a person, and they saw that in you. They felt like if they were to go with you, they would have tainted that, and they didn't want to because they knew they were toxic, right? The devil's in reverse, yeah, there we go. They want to reclaim their power or they want to release from whatever addictive behaviors that they've had in the past or, or currently doing. Maybe they share that with the distorted queen. Mm. They feel powerless at times, helpless, imprisoned in the situation they're in now, eight of swords. Yeah, imbalance, there it goes. Mm, love overextending themselves in all directions you know I think the fear of the unknown is what stopped them the risk yeah kept them where they were <laughs> two of wands uh, sent them back to the person who was familiar is what I'm hearing from spirit but they really want an opportunity with you and they dream about that. But the magicians in reverse here, they were tricked. Yeah, they really were by this other person. Turn their head. And they wish they could take back what happened. And they wish that you would forgive them. They made a choice. The lovers is here. And it was all showy eyes and pretty Pay 1717 on the clock, whether it was a man or a woman, and mm, snap the trap, baby. But you were such a loving person, and they wish they would have given, given you their everything and not this other person who didn't deserve it. Thank you so much for joining me in Empress Aries 88. Please like and subscribe and join my tribe because I would love to have you. Until next time, be safe out there, my friends. Be blessed.